here's a question when you detect twins on ultrasound what is the single most important thing to determine next it's not gender it's chorionicity and the key clue is the twin peak sign also called the lambda sign because of its resemblance to the greek letter lambda the twin peak sign refers to a triangular projection of placental tissue that extends between the layers of the intertwin membrane at its base forming a shape like the greek letter lambda the base of the echogenic triangle is the placental surface and the apex extends into the thick intertwin membrane the intertwin membrane is also thicker this appearance indicates that the pregnancy is dichorionic and diamniotic that is dcda meaning each fetus has its own chorion and amnion it is best seen between 10 to 14 weeks of gestation when the intertwin membrane inserts into the placenta at a broad angle to identify this sign confidently use a high frequency transvaginal or transabdominal probe focus on the membrane placental junction and a broad based echogenic wedge of tissue between sacs is the lambda sign it is simple visual and highly reproducible as gestation advances and the placenta grows this triangular projection may flatten or disappear so early diagnosis matters let's recall in dichorionic and diamniotic twins the intertwin membrane is thicker made up of two amnions and two chorions in monochorionic diamniotic twins only two amnions are present making the dividing membrane thin and there is no placental tissue projection this gives the t sign so twin peak sign equals dichorionic whereas t sign equals monochorionic studies show that when performed before 14 weeks the twin peak sign has nearly 100% sensitivity and specificity for identifying dichorionicity determining chorionicity early is crucial because monochorionic twins carry high risk twin to twin transfusion syndrome selective growth restriction and cord complications in summary twin peak that is lambda equals dichorionic and diamniotic check early before 14 weeks remember recognizing the twin peak sign early helps ensure optimal monitoring safer outcomes and smarter obstetric decisions for more insights into early pregnancy ultrasound markers subscribe to my channel and stay tuned also to learn more about the different signs of pregnancy seen on ultrasound and about ultrasound in obstetrics in general please read my book practical obstetrics and gynecology 7th edition which has been just released